Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So today's video is going to be my what I got for Christmas video. Now if you have been following me on any social media platforms or on my second channel, I did Vlogmas over there, you will know that I have moved house. I'm still really kind of getting used to everything so I'm sorry if this video is quite dark, like down here is really dark but up here is really light. <laughs> I wanted to do this video just to kind of complete my 12 days of Christmas because as I moved I didn't really have well I had no Wi-Fi. I was gonna say I didn't have good Wi-Fi. I had no Wi-Fi and then towards the end of the month I just kind of put everything up so I wanted to kind of just do this video to complete my 12 days of Christmas. I have never done this kind of video before a what I got for Christmas video. This is not a showy off video. I have not received a car, a house, a private jet. I do not have anything like that. I had quite a few of you ask if I was gonna do one this year and I wasn't sure. So I did like a little poll on my Twitter and the majority of you guys said that you would like to see one. So that is what I am doing. I thought it'd be a nice way to finish off the Christmas videos. I've been waiting a little while to film this video. I basically had Christmas Day and obviously opened my presents on Christmas Day and then Boxing Day I opened more presents and then the day after Boxing Day up until about New Year really I was away at Centre Parks and I had some more presents then so I've only really just finished my Christmas present opening if that makes sense like everything all together so I wanted to just wait until I had everything for this video so that is why it is up late because I know everyone tends to put them up like on Christmas day but that just has not been the case for me so I'm going to stop babbling on and I'm going to get into the video I feel like this is one of those videos where I'm just going to have to keep on changing the lighting Woo! there are a few things that I did get for Christmas that I don't have anymore because that was vouchers chocolate and money and they went straight away the first one I'll start off with my friend Harriet she got me the magic wand bubble bar which I love and I actually had used the last of the one I previously had before I moved so she got me the magic wand bubble bar which is just oh, so amazing like I love the scent of this just in the bathroom oh, I've got to put it away I've got to put it away and then she also got me the snowman shower jelly since I went to the Halloween event at Lush I've really gotten into the shower jellies like I absolutely love them I think they're amazing in the shape of a little snowman it's so cute and I really really like that and then she also got me two bits from soap and glory the first thing is the face soap this is a fit vitamin is a vitamin so it's a vitamin facial wash and I had actually gone shopping on Christmas Eve and I saw this in boots and I was gonna get it and I was like no don't get it you don't need to buy it and I literally opened it the next day and I was like, oh my god. I'll definitely do like a blog post on this because I really am excited to try it. And then she also got me the makeup remover from Soap and Glory, which again, I've never tried and I've run out of all like my um, micella or micella waters. So that's what I got from Harriet. Very, very nice. There are a few little like random things. So I'm just like going to dive into those. I got this Rituals perfume, which is in like the cutest little bottle and it's got like a gold wooden top on it and I really really like it and I didn't know Rituals did uh, perfume but this is the Voyage on In. It smells kind of Tom Fordish. Tom Fordish but it does. And I got this perfume which I've never heard of this brand before. Chacharel? Chacharel? I don't know. Um, and it is a more and more in this like little red bottle with like a uh, clip on it but it's just so cool and again a really nice this is a lighter scent oh, I'm gonna smell amazing today I also got the Ted Baker Eau de Toilette and this is in like such a funky packaging this again is a really light scent it's what size is this 75 ml so this is definitely gonna last me a long old time but I think it's such a cool cool looking bottle like I really really like it so that's that and that's quite a fresh scent as well like a really light scent next perfume I got I actually got quite a lot of perfume as Chanel Chance this was from my aunt who always buys me this for like Christmas or birthdays I think this is the original one correct me if I'm wrong but I know Chanel haven't like brought out a different range of Chance like there's different like 
notes and undernotes and undertones and overtones and mixes of things. This is my favourite chance. I'm so glad to actually film this video so I know I can use it but I absolutely love it and it is obviously super super nice that it is Chanel so that's that and I'm wearing you today and then I think the last perfume I got is this which is the YSL black opium but this is like a gift set and then on the inside you obviously have the perfume which is a I want to say 30 mil I want to say 30 mil 30 mil yep and you get like a 10 mil like travel one which is so good so yeah this is one of my all-time favorites as well as the Chanel one. This is like an amazing one for like the evening. I'm really trying to open the box but I really can't. This one is the smaller bottle but that is perfect for like again in your car in your handbag. I wish that they sold those separately. And this is the main event itself. I absolutely love this bottle so much. It's absolutely stunning to just look at. This is a definitely a heavier scent, like a darker scent. Oh, but it's still like amazing. I think that was all the perfume that I got. Then I got this, which is the Lee Stafford Chopper Stick Styler. I really wanted to get a different kind of hair curler because I used to have like a wand, but it's like thinner at the end and then it goes out like that, if that makes sense. My hair is also quite flat, so I like to try and get as many curls out of it as possible to make my hair look thicker. So Leah got this from a secret Santa and about three days before Christmas, I said to my mum, Mum, I know, I found it. Um, and it was this one. So I actually went to Tesco with her and got it. And if anyone wants this, it's cheaper in Tesco than anywhere else that I've seen it. I think it's £14.99. I might do like a get ready with me video using it or something. But um, I'm excited to try it and see what it's like because I am loving curled hair at the moment. So that is that. Then I got this from my cousin, which is a Yankee Candle set it's a little bit ripped because i ripped it no let's just open it inside it are two yankee candles the first one is snowflake cookie which is a very fresh scent as you can probably tell very light and sweet i really like that and i like the color of it as well and then the other one is the cozy by the fire oh it just smells amazing it smells like bonfire night that's what it smells like it smells like bonfire night that's those little ones. My other cousin had bought me these, which are little tree decorations. They're from Harrods. So there's a snowflake one, there's a Christmas tree one, and there's a present one. But they're so, so cute. I absolutely love them. And they have the little Harrods tag on there as well. But I absolutely love those. So that's that. And she also got me a mug which says best friend on it which I think is really nice because she's my best friend and then my other cousin got me a bottle of let me see hello blend of black currant juice and white wine but it's also in a really nice bottle so that is that and I can now down you then I got this which is a Fujifilm Instax mini 70 instant camera in the color moon white i've been wanting one of these for a little while but i really wasn't sure whether to get one or not like i really i really didn't know and my friend has one and she said they were really good but i think she has a slightly different one to me maybe she has the mini i'm not sure but apparently the mini has better reviews than the other one so um that's why my mom got me the mini one this is what it looks like i am obsessed with this i haven't like spent the time to figure out all the settings because there's all different settings like on the back all i know is that you switch it on you hold it up and you smile that's all i know there's one i took of my doggy on christmas day this is one i took when i was at center park so you can see like it was misty anyway but um yeah it wasn't amazing outdoors but i think there is a setting so if anyone has one please can you let me know how to use it it also has a mirror here on the front so you can do like a selfie mode and take a picture of yourself i'm actually so happy that i've got the mini because if it's perfectly in my handbag i don't have to worry about trying to fit it in because the other one is a lot chunkier whereas this is like really slim as you can see so that's that the last few bits are in here oh I got this diary which is from Sainsbury's because I spotted it with my mum and I saw it and I just really really liked it I don't know if it's like the inner 
blogger in me just liked all the glitter but it says 2017 on the front it just has like every day you can write a lot in there which I like to do my brother got me this which is the Zoella snap fizz relax like bubble bar bath fizzer set I want to say probably got me that which I thought was really cute so that's that and then I think the last thing is like more of what my main present was which if you have watched my second channel I went to the spa at Centre Parks in I want to say October I had an Elemis facial and it was the first one that I'd ever had the girl there had recommended a few products for me to try and she said they were cheaper in the Christmas gift sets so the only thing I really had asked for for Christmas was some Elemis facial stuff because it was just something new that I wanted to try so I just kind of said to my mum if you can get me anything I'll be like super grateful so she got me the dynamic resurfacing gel mask they all come in really nice boxes these are all products that the girl recommended for my skin type which I would say is kind of dry skin an oily t-zone and I have like a bit of scarring she said down here this is what it looks like I'm so excited to try it I might do like a updated skincare routine like just using them or like reviewing the whole range because you'll see there's quite a bit if you'd like to see that do let me know but that is that's the first one I got second thing I got was the dynamic resurfacing facial wash again another recommendation for my skin type this says it is just a skin smoothing cleanser so that's that next thing is the dynamic resurfacing night cream so obviously this is all like the same range she had recommended the day cream for me as well but I said I'd rather have a night cream than a day cream this feels amazing on the skin I've just like done a little bit in the most awkward place ever. I'm gonna try this tonight for the first time because now I've opened everything, I feel like I can use it all properly. So that's that. And then there was this bigger box within the box. Yeah, that's right. <laughs> and inside, all nicely wrapped up, was a mini facial wash, which I think is a super good size for travel. And then there is the Elemis Gentle Rose Exfoliator, which smells incredible oh it smells so good so I can't wait to try that but that wasn't recommended to me that must have just been like something you could get free with da -da 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 -da, the Elemis Pro Collagen Cleansing Balm if you have followed my channel for a while you will know that I am in love with the Emma Hardy amazing face Moringa Cleansing Balm but I ran out of that I'm not sure how much this is compared to the Emma Hardy one. I presume it's either gonna be around the same or more, but the Emma Hardy one is, I wanna say 38 pound 50. I should know, I bought so many. I just stick my card in like, just do it quick. I run out of the Emma Hardy one, and I think I must have mentioned this to my mom, because I don't think it was written down, but this basically just dissolves your makeup. You can see that I've touched it, but I don't wanna touch it again, but I do wanna touch it, because I wanna use it. Also comes with a muslin cloth, which is, essential for something like this but that is basically everything that i have got for christmas i would love to know what you all got for christmas do let me know down below in the comments section i hope that you all had a lovely christmas and new year if you enjoyed this video give it a thumbs up and make sure to subscribe videos are now going to be back on track sundays at 6 p.m sorry that this video has gone up late but it is the best i can do with being away and being ill videos will be back to normal sundays at 6 p.m and i'm obviously vlogging over on my second channel so make sure to check that out if you would like to and i will see you all very soon for another video